We're going to look at a plugin tonight that does one specific thing that I do all the time, and it is called Enveloper. It is a really awesome plugin for changing the basic envelope of your sound. That's your attack, decay, sustain, release. In this case, we're doing with audio, but uh, a lot of times you do this with synthesizers or sometimes with MIDI instruments and things, but we're using some audio loops and changing their specific envelope. So, in this case, we're going to be working with changing the room sound. Let's mute this bass and just listen to two different drum kits. Here's the first and here's the second. So you can hear quite a bit of the room sound around that. Now we can't do anything about the actual original recordings because these are just the stereo loops. But we're going to use a plugin. It's inside Dynamics and it's called Enveloper. Now this allows us to change uh, specific parts of the sound. I don't want to actually get too much into this whole plugin right now. This is really just more of a quick tip uh, and using one of the, the default uh, presets here. It's called Room Killer. And as you can see, specifically, the release is what we're pulling down. Instead of pushing it up, we're going to get rid of that release. And we're setting the threshold to be on permanently. And then the time, you'll see how that adjusts as well. But we're not, we're essentially taking this to the extreme. Now listen to this first one. What we're missing right off the bat would be that cymbal sound, which we might want actually to have some decay with it, but if we want, we can adjust a little bit longer. You can definitely hear We've changed the overall sound there. Let's try the second one. So we can get a much more controlled sound, uh, removing some of the room from the sound uh, while still keeping the basic elements intact. However, changing the sound can be really easy depending on the time, the gain, and the threshold. Through all of these settings, we can really do some drastic pumping. We can really change the overall dynamics of different parts of the sound. I love this plugin you should all be using it. Okay, that's it for today. Just want to show you this one thing, the Room Killer preset, and I will see you tomorrow.